Hey everybody, I am walking back from a nature, a little, I wouldn't say hike, but nature walk. And I just had a little walking meditation. Uh, I thought it was 20 minutes, but it ended up being longer. Because I didn't hear the timer go off, and I gotta get back home. But, uh, anyhow, um, this this uh, video is about um, something that I'm really realizing in my life. And uh, hope hopefully... Uh, you'll realize this too and, and try it out is um, expanding your awareness everybody wants to raise their consciousness and uh, really what that means is expanding your awareness and you can do that an easy way to do that is the way you look at the world actually is um, is, a, is a great symptom of your state of consciousness and so though that not that it's bad to focus but on one thing but what uh, I've noticed is when I'm in the states of highest states of consciousness if you want to call it that most expanded awareness my vision is broader it's like it's like um, more expanded I, I'm, I'm not looking as pointedly and so something you can do is you can do it anywhere and I've sort of alluded to this in my uh, in my a couple of my other videos about just looking around Eckhart Tolle talks about this too um, so if you like I just watched um, Celestine Prophecies which I really recommend um, it's sort of not the best quality movie ever but um, but the message is great I love it and uh it ta it, there's a scene in there where she gets the guy to hold his fingers together to look for the energy in between his fingers and then she gets him to look into nature and she's like just relax your eyes just just take it all in and um, well I haven't personally seen energy yet I know people that do and um, I feel it and uh, so anyhow a way of getting out of the mind and raising your consciousness is just by um, expanding your vision so instead of like looking at specific particular sort of things look at just look make your vision sort of expand so that um, you're taking more in and, and it's not you're not quite blurring your vision but it's almost like that. It's like you just sort of, I don't know if you'll be able to tell the difference while I'm looking at the camera, let's see. So now I'm looking directly at the camera and now I'm sort of looking wider. I don't know if you can tell the difference. Let me know. <laughs> or I guess I'll watch it at some point. But um, so this is something you can do. And I mean, this is, this is why we suffer anyhow is because you know, it's like, for example, with a thought, when we hold on to a thought, when we cling to a thought, when we make it our focus, that's the only time we suffer. When, when we see there are thoughts, there are, you know, there's judgment here. I, I was judging that. Okay, I was, you know, I judged that just now or whatever, you know. Then, then it doesn't become such a big deal, you know, when you sort of distance yourself from the thoughts and just see them and uh, sort of expand your awareness so you can see ah you're not you're not trapped by the thinker anymore you're you're seeing the thinker because the thinker is not you the thoughts are not you they're not me and anytime we get upset it's because we become the thinker or at least we've mistaken ourselves to be the thinker and so this little exercise is something I'm going to continue doing and, um, and I hope you'll uh, try it so you just look around wherever you are it can be in nature nature's great because it's so big it doesn't feel like a box like in your house but you could do it in your house just as easily and just look around just just look and take in a wider perspective in your and your consciousness will will uh, become wider 
and you'll have a greater perspective of life. So I love you and I will talk to you soon. Hope everybody has a lovely day and uh, I hope this little tip is something that you'll take into your for the rest of your life into your uh, days and uh, just relax it's all about relaxing a little bit and uh, not getting so wrapped up in the immediacy of things and and being so so focused on the little things it's about seeing the big picture so anyways love you guys peace